It takes your ear hole and it goes like this. It just all up in your, it just takes up. All right, today I'm checking out Kaz Hawkins. I'm listening to the song, Because You Love Me. Let's get into it. standing out the most to you guys about this song in the beginning you got the beautiful music which actually oddly enough for some reason it reminds me of classical music in a way and it is probably not anything close but the way it makes me feel hearing the music reminds me of classical music you got the lyrics because you love me this is a love song which i don't even know 100 what's going on like don't leave don't go because you told me so whoop de woo you got all that stuff but then when you get to the vocals she has such a big robust voice it takes up all of my ear all of my brain listening abilities you know like some vocals might like nasally which is like a little higher maybe a little sharper and it just goes in your ear you know it goes in your ear like this boom the nasal vocals then you got like really low vocals which i had a little bit bigger and whatnot but this is like a full spectrum very robust singing it takes your ear hole and it goes like this it is all up in your, it just takes up everything. You get what I'm saying? How some voices, it feels like it goes in a part of your ear, which is probably actually your brain. Like you use a part of your brain to process it. This feels like the full spectrum, like the real deal. Like it takes up my whole brain listening capacity or my whole ear hole. However this listening stuff works, this is all of it. That's what I'm trying to say. Full spectrum is the best word I got for it.
about her voice that's so different like we've listened to plenty of artists who have big voices and things i don't know man something about her voice it just feels balanced almost like like that's the best analogy i have is it takes up my whole ear hole like you someone else's voice may be like a little skewed to one side or the other a little off balance hers just feels like perfectly balanced pure right in the center fills up your man's whole ear hole and that's really i'm just circling around that same phrase and i don't know i don't know it just feels it feels different. It makes me feel different, but I don't know what I'm feeling. I was thinking, have you ever heard a song and it just makes you like feel emotiony, emotional, but you don't even know the emotion? And, and I probably would know the emotion maybe if I knew exactly what was going on. I was saying it's a love song. Is this a breakup song? She's like, don't wait for me because I can't leave, I can't go, and all that. I don't know 100%. It sounds like you love someone so much you're letting them go kind of thing that's going on. And that's why I don't even know the emotion. It just feels emotional. The delivery, the music, everything, put it all together. The emotion is being emotional. That's what I'm feeling listening to this, but I can't put my finger on it. Like, I can't pinpoint what it is that I'm feeling. But it's the voice that really has me tripped up. It's like, oh, I need a better vocal vocabulary, if that makes any sense. It's like you hear so many different vocal styles, and then it's just be like little nuances that separate one style from the other. I gotta find the words and the, the little nuance that can tell you about one person's voice versus the other. Cause you know, a lot of singers can sing really well. It's all great, beautiful voice, big voice, nasally voice, alt rock voice, kind of talk singing, you know, a bunch of different basic vocals. But when it comes to two similar vocal styles, what's the difference between the two? How do you explain the difference between the two? And I find myself tripped up on what makes her vocal sound so different. But I did my best job at trying to explain to you what I was feeling listening to her. But I don't know, what are you guys feeling listening to her? I don't know. Tell me, man, what do you know? What do you know? Me and my boys on the road. You the go. She told me, boy, you the go. Like, I don't know. 